Hey everyone, so it's me again. I'm going to try and make this video not too long. <laughs> I'm sick, so excuse I have a runny nose. Yeah. <laughs> and I sound gross, but anyway. So I wanted to tell you a couple of things and yeah. So um, first of all, before I like, get into the video, um, I decided that I'll let you guys know my Instagram, so I'll put a link in the description to my Instagram and also it's on my channel page, so if you're watching this, like on my channel, it's, you know, up here somewhere, way over there, or over there, I'm confused, <laughs> um, but I'll put a link in the description and um, you can also um, follow me on Ask FM and check out my YouTube Facebook page. I'm, so, I'm sorry, this is self-promotion, but um, I've never told you some of these things. And also, you can add me on Snapchat, so if you would like to add me on Snapchat, I'll add all of you. If you add me, I'll, I'll accept. Um, and my Snapchat, I'll put... No, I probably can't put a link. My Snapchat is so great is Kate, and Kate is C-A-I-T. So it's S-O-G-R-E-A-T-I-S. C A I T. So so great is Kate. <laughs> um, it was an idea for another channel that I was gonna make. Well I did make, so maybe I might uh, don't worry. Don't worry about it. Snap out of it. Oh gosh. Okay. So yeah, I wanted to tell you a couple of secrets because um, as a human being, I have many. I don't really have any deep dark, super duper secrets that are like really really a big deal but um, I have many and some I'm definitely not telling you <laughs> because um, I'm a bit too scared <laughs> but I'll tell you a few and the first one's really embarrassing and oh my gosh I can't believe I'm even telling you this but okay so I'm 17 right um, and when I was 15 I found my first grey hair <laughs> it's so embarrassing I think I was 15, maybe 14. I was in year 9 or year 10, I can't remember. But, like, I've never dyed my hair or anything, so you can tell I don't actually have, like, full head of grey hair yet. <laughs> um, but I was, like, with my friends, and it was at sport or something, and someone was, like, doing one of my other friend's hair, and, like, oh, you've got a grey hair, to someone else. And then I was, like, looking, and then I was, like, oh, my God, I found a grey hair. I've only found about like five all up. Four, five, four, five, four, five, four, five, five, four, five, four, five, five, I think. <laughs> anyway, and every time I found one, I've like yanked that thing out and I'm like, no grey hair for me. I'm not ready. I'm too young. I'm too young to go grey. So I know it's embarrassing, but I told you guys, I've done it. It's out there. You'll you all know. Um. Oh gosh, okay, so tell me if you are young and you found grey hair because, oh, I'm scared. I'm scared to go grey. Which kind of leads on to my next secret. I'm like super duper scared of like mortality and like death in general. Uh, it just freaks me out how like nothing is certain and that, you know, it, any, any moment could be anyone's last and it's just it just freaks me out and I can't stop thinking about it to like every time I go to bed at night I just can't stop thinking about like mortality <laughs> and like death and all of that and it's really not that good to like think about too much but oh wow like wow ugh so many thoughts but it I guess it's kind of a good thing because it helps me to remember to make the most of every moment that I have so sort of it's sort of bittersweet. Like I'm always like super scared of like everything, and every time we like say goodbye to someone, it's just like intense. But ugh, okay, before I get too crazy, but yeah, most of my secrets that I'm telling you guys are just my fears because I have many. So let's just call this secrets and fears. Secrets and fears. Um. You know, it surrounds me pretty little eyes. I wish I had like all these deep dark secrets like them. <laughs> um, but unfortunately one one of them will have to be dead if they're going to actually keep a secret. 
I'm, I'm not telling you my deepest, darkest secrets, but another secret I have is I'm scared of the dark. <laughs> like, legitimately freaked out. I'm too scared to turn off the lights in the house. Like, downstairs, we've got like, um, like in our kitchen, it's a really big like kitchen and family room like joined into one. And you have to like start turning the light off like furthest away from like the doorway. So you have to like go turn that off and then the lights go off and then you have to like run and then turn them off. And I hate turning them off every time my dad says, well, if you stay up late and watching TV, you turn the lights off. I'm like, okay, I'll go to bed. You can turn them off. It just freaks me out. I hate being in the dark, even in my own home. I just hate it. I'm scared of the dark. I do now sleep with my light off and door shut when I used to always um, like leave the door on and have like the passage light, uh, leave the door open and have the passageway light because I'm scared of the dark. Like I only started shutting, like keeping it close um, probably a couple of years ago, like two years or something because my sisters started staying up, my younger sisters started staying up later than me and they would be like all noisy. <laughs> so now I sleep with it shut, but, um, I have to keep, like, my, my, I have to keep, like, either my phone on or my lamp or anything until, like, I'm right tucked in in bed and then I, like, jump in and then quickly turn it off. And every time I need to, like, get up it during the night, I, like, turn all my lights on and everything so I can get out of my room. It's ridiculous, but I'm honestly afraid. I remember we went in, um... Oh, when was it? Year nine on a city camp, and we went to Old Melbourne Jail with school. And it's like meant to be like haunted and things. Um, it's like where Ned Kelly was kept for a bit. I think he died there, maybe. I don't know. Um, don't quote me on that, I might be an idiot. Um, well, I am. <laughs> but my friend was trying to scare me the whole time and I was literally like almost in tears and the whole two were like other people like being scared and everyone was like oh you're trying to get attention and stuff but literally I was almost in tears I was that afraid I'm scared of anything supernatural I totally believe in like all supernatural things and like ghosts and spirits and demons and all of that I 100% believe in it and I'm scared of it I'm scared of it all just everything. I, I'm just a, I'm just a scaredy cat in general. Some of my friends like think it's really funny because I'm scared to do a lot of things. But yeah, okay, that's yeah, okay. <laughs> okay, so I don't know. Eh. <laughs> that just sounds really weird. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to tell you anything else, like, secrety, but, um, secrety. Secrety, 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 secretish, secret-like, secrety, whatever. I don't know if I'll tell you any more secrets, but this isn't really secret, it's not hidden, but you guys probably don't know about it, but, well, you guys probably don't know, I don't know if I've told anyone. This is not really a secret. I'm telling you. Okay. okay. <laughs> I love Harry Potter and um, when I was, I must have been like five and I first saw like the first movie. This was before I read the books. I read the books when I was seven. Yeah, I read the books when I was, I started reading the books when I was seven. When I was seven, they weren't all out. But I started reading the books when I was seven, but anyway, when I was five, I f saw the first movie, and my sister and I were obsessed, and would always, like, play Harry Potter, and she would be Hermione, and I would be Harry's, like, twin sister, or something, and I'd pretend I had, like, a scar on my arm instead of, like, on my forehead or something like that, and we were, like, you know, and I'd pretend I was his sister, but actually I was totally in love with him, and I wanted to just be... Harry Potter's girlfriend, and trust me, I still do. If Harry Potter, if you're watching this, operate in my room right now, and I'll marry you. Trust me. Trust. So yeah, I wish I was a real witch. Maybe I am. Maybe that's the big secret. Um, but if it was, I wouldn't tell you. Of course. Uh, but yeah, I wish I was. 
um, a witch and I wish I was British so that I could actually go to um, good old Hogwarts because I don't know if there's an Australian wizard, witchcraft and wizardry school but if there is I wouldn't tell you because unless you're uh, actually a witch or a wizard but yeah so hopefully this helped you get to know a bit more about me and it was a bit boring but whatever if you like these kind of videos with me telling you stuff blast from the past whatever um you know you know you know you know oh gosh I'm cold just got a shiver um so yeah I love you really <laughs> what's that really 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 I feel like the wiggles you point your fingers and do the twist. That's another secret. I was like, in prep, I went to a Wiggles concert and I was so embarrassed. I Because I was five, right? And I was embarrassed that I liked the Wiggles. I was too old for the Wiggles. Um, and I, like, it was like during the school day and I left to go to the Wiggles. And I like didn't tell anyone where I was going because I was so embarrassed. <laughs> and then I bought a Wiggles lunchbox, and I was so embarrassed that I took it to like when I took it to school, even though I was like five, six, seven, and I was so embarrassed. And like when people were like, oh, I like your lunchbox, I was like, oh, cringe. They hate my lunchbox. <laughs> but yeah, okay, all right, that's it. That's it. That's all. That is just okay. I've said bye already, haven't I? Maybe? I don't know. Okay. Alright. Toodaloo. Cheerio. Au revoir. And I'll see you later. I'll see you tomorrow, maybe. Or the next day, or the next day, or the next day, or sometime after that, or who knows, because unfortunately, you and I are mortal, so yeah. That's sad. Okay. No, I love you. You'll live forever, like, and ever and ever and ever, and I love you. Okay, I love you. Oh, that was mean. I feel bad now. Okay. Alright, bye.